Fabiana Corona and Gata Kamsky here with us. The game finished in favor of Fabiana Corona and we are very thankful for Gata that he also joined the press conference. So first let's let's check uh, how was the game proceeding. Um, okay, the opening is just a typical anti-martial. Um, okay, I mean there's many options on, I think, well, knight d8 is usually played more often, although here white has some option to play c3, d4. So, um, yeah, I guess, I mean, g6 looked a little bit strange to me, but actually black got a quite a decent position, so it's probably also okay. I was expecting uh, knight e6, and, um, and I was thinking about knight g5 here to try to to kind of damage black's pawn structure, or c5, maybe black can avoid it. And I think knight f5, knight e6 is not so dangerous for black. Even if I take this, then this type of position, uh, I don't know how to take back. Maybe with the queen, and black will try to achieve d5 somewhere. Um, okay, so g6, I just tried to make some normal moves. Actually, I think we played quite correct here, and um, yeah, this is some typical idea why it just wants to play c4, b4, and, and try to create some pressure on the queen side. Uh, if bishop f8, I was. Uh, wait. Yeah, let's say bishop f8, I was thinking about I was going to play b4. And I mean, these dark squares aren't so important uh, because I'm controlling them. And uh, on the king side, black is a little bit weak. I think king h8 was correct because if b4 now, knight g8. And if I have to retreat, then black somewhere has ideas of f5, and it could be uncomfortable for me. Even immediately, I wasn't sure about f5. Knight g5, um, yeah, again, if bishop f8, I think I'll take. And this type of position, I thought I have some small plus. Although maybe it's not so much. So this seems quite interesting, because black is achieving f5 here. Um, yeah, okay, the critical moment is around here. Um, yeah, f4, and... I don't know, it seems not so bad for black, but I'm not sure how he should play. So, yeah, in the game I got some unpleasant pressure, of course. I was wondering about, you know, let's say, take, take, and knight f6. Something like this might have been uh, an opportunity for black. Uh, maybe, I mean, I can try to play queen g5, but it's a bit double-edged here, because my king is also very weak. So I, I wasn't sure what I would do here. I can also just play some kind of positional moves, like bishop b3 or something. Uh, and yeah, it's, um, it looks quite unpleasant, actually. Black's king is always very weak. Yeah, okay. Maybe Kata also can say something about the position, and in general, how did he choose to play this opening? I mean, it's a decisive game, and it's how normally grandmasters make a choice bef be before such an important game, let's say. Well, okay, uh, g6 was probably a mistake, um, because, you know, the, the king is um, always weak. But later in the game, I thought, you know, I had some chances here. Okay, so go forward, because uh, I think the critical position is after h5, which was, uh, I thought was correct. And then h4, probably, why not? And um, knight f1, so take, 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 g5. And also, of course, I could play g5 immediately, um, which is also interesting. G5 Instead one. of taking the forge, g5 here. Because mm -hmm. white has to take on e5. And now. Just in case we second also. And now you just take on e5. You have to take on f5, rook f5. I could also play knight e3, f5, but maybe it's. I'm not sure what it is. It's kind of a strange position. Okay, but black is okay here. I mean, uh, completely blocked. Yeah, no, it's not very clear. No, I, I, I think I was planning to take. Yeah, or maybe take. with the rook, I don't know. Rook takes. Knight somewhere. Also a natural moves. Then, yeah, just, uh, probably slightly better for white, but uh, this was probably a better version. Because... Maybe not. Uh, I, I don't know. Okay, so I'll go back, take, take, and um, g5, take on f5. And I, and I felt this was uh, equal position. You could also maybe play g4, it's interesting. g4 and f6. Yeah, f6, knight takes. Take. Check. 
seven. Mm, I don't like this much. Um, yeah, it's very risky for black. I was thinking about rookie six also with some kind of rook h six threats. Bishop e six, like you have so many moves. Yeah, bishop e six, and then queen d eight, I guess. Okay, I think you should take in general. Just it was an option. Yeah, take, take, and of course I, sh I should play king h seven here. I, uh, I have no idea okay. why I didn't play this. And I guess knight e three. Knight f three, just queen f four. Because I have time for knight f six, and then black is completely okay. I have no idea why I didn't play this. Knight, can I uh, attack like this? Mm. Well, I can probably even play knight e seven. Or well, it looks kind of dangerous for you when you're queen two and mm. uh, the brave move king g6 maybe. <laughs> yeah, it's okay, trade. Okay, but here I feel yeah, it okay. should be an attack. Okay. Yeah, and it's just not enough time to figure this out. But okay, I guess but just um And this is also very close to I think Queen of Seven should have been played. Yeah, queen of seven, and I was going to go to b8. <coughs> yeah, b8, and then something simple like... Uh, maybe queen of four. Or yeah, maybe, maybe even knight of six, or I don't know. But you were... Maybe you remove something like queen of seven. Uh, I like, like so many moves here, and no time. Yeah. Has like, yeah. You know, no, it feels... Knight, knight h6, okay, just play knight h6. And but uh, you... Yeah, queen of seven would be knight h6. You but you're, you're pinned? Ah, making so. Okay, sorry about that. No, maybe queen a7 is correct. Queen a7 would be 5. And uh, I have d4 in the end. Mm. Rook e7, d4, right? Yeah, okay, well, I just landed by that, so, yeah. Yeah, I mean, okay. Queen King h7 was just a blunder, I guess. Yeah, okay, I mean... I had g4, I had Yeah, g4, course. and... Uh, but I win a pawn here, I guess, with rook e4. Queen a7. And, um... Um... So maybe d4 here? Knight f6. Maybe queen of seven here. Seven and I'm completely okay. Yeah, it's, it's not very clear, of course. Yeah, yeah. king h seven was just a blunder. Yeah, king h seven. I didn't see it. Okay, but then, like, yeah, g four had to be played, of course. Yeah. And Fabian, actually, after this game which you had yesterday, how do how did you feel? How did you find strength to play today? Oh well, I was extremely lucky yesterday, and I mean, I didn't even consider that I might have a chance to to still be in you know the race for first, but um. Uh, okay, I was just very happy, and um, and today things kind of went, I mean, went my way. Although it could have been, of course, uh, I was quite nervous before the game. I wasn't sure, you know. <laughs> After my play in the last four rounds has been very erratic, so okay, it's just a very good end to the tournament. Mm -hmm. And Gata, how do you estimate this tournament in general and your um, result, the final result? Well, okay, it's a nice tournament, and. Um I tried my best and, uh, you know, just have to do it. <laughs> what can you do? <laughs> okay. yeah. Do we have questions yeah. to players? Any question? Um, okay, no question. Thank you very much for coming.